My name is Lou Beckerman. I work as a, a healing arts practitioner, a nurse and a sound and song therapist. And I've been involved for many years in helping people to connect with their voices and have more confidence when they're trying to communicate with voice. An idea, a seed of an idea was sown and um, about a year ago we decided to go ahead with this project of actually forming a chorus uh, that would have a specific name and an identity and people would feel they actually belonged to a chorus and could grow together through a community of sounding through song. <laughs> Simmons and I'm the communication support coordinator for the Mid-Sussex area and I run a communication support group here in Cookfield and also in Crawley. I think I've noticed a real shift in their confidence and the le their levels of participation. So uh, probably in January people were a little bit unsure and taking part but maybe tentatively. Uh, and over the weeks and months they've really come alive. They often burst into song. One lady this morning has just started spontaneously singing We'll Meet Again and they sing Hello Dolly. And these aren't songs that we've actually done in the chorus. Um, so th there's much more a sense of sort of energy and um, a community sense of working on a project I have seen a lot of benefits. I've certainly seen a, an increased uh, level of confidence and um, a much more participation and involvement, which is great. So um, some people have been in this uh, Stroke Association group um, pr practicing communication and uh, doing all sorts of activities but this uh, chorus project has really um, freed them up a little bit so they often burst into song and uh, generally there's a great sense of well-being and happiness and I think they probably go home with lifted spirits. Well I've certainly seen people grow in confidence and look forward to singing rather than holding back because people are always surprised, they think they can't do it. They think if they can't speak, then they can't sing. But there's a part of the brain that holds the lyrics of songs meshed in with the melody, which is a totally different part of the brain that holds language. So they surprise themselves when it's a familiar tune and they start singing the lyrics. Uh, it, it, you can see the confidence in their eyes and the surprise and, and the wanting to do more. <laughs> Yes, definitely. Yes, yes, yes. That's really good, isn't yes, it? Yes, I, 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 yes, yes, I, I, yes, ice. Ba, 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 ba. It's, yes. it's so good. For, it's so good for speech, and also it brings everybody together, doesn't it? Yes. And you meet loads of people. Yes. It's improved his speech and his level of sound, hasn't yes, it? Yes. 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 Now. Yes. He's yes. Good? Yes. 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 And you have a goal. Yes. 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 Yeah. T tell me about your your ambition. Yes. Uh, yeah. Around the, the world, world in eighty. Days. Okay. 
Okay, and you can do this with some friends or? Yes, uh, yes. You, we're one of us. Yes. We're go not being you. invited. <laughs> we do get requests. Generally, it needs to be songs that are familiar songs that uh, people will know and will be able to access in that particular part of the brain. We have tried learning um, a few simple um, choruses uh, and sometimes it's okay and sometimes it isn't. Um, but certainly what we find is we're giving people almost permission to start using their voices again. Occasionally there have been requests, yes, uh, some people have got favourites, but Lou's chosen most of them um, mainly because they're, they're very moving songs and they're quite relevant to people's situations. Sometimes they touch on um, sadness but actually coping with that sadness and um, they often show a lot of courage in the songs, so Lou has chosen ones which um, were possibly already known to them, most of them were already known to them, but uh, ones that are very popular and um, so, yes, largely her choice. I really would recommend uh, a project like this. It could be very, very simple, but I would recommend it so much. It's been um, so beneficial and, and enjoyable um, to everyone, volunteers, carers who've come along and perhaps um, sat next to the person and shared the um, song sheet. They can then take it home and do it. I'd recommend it so much. Yes, I think it's one of the best things we've ever done. Well, we decided on a name, and that was Singing in the Rain Chorus. It seemed symbolic that we were you know singing through the darkness into something better and uh, so i guess singing in the rain is our signature tune